Hey everyone, Edward here and welcome to Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to install the latest Windows 11 printer drivers. The first and most obvious solution to try out in this case is to use Windows Update. Press the Windows button, then simply type Update and then click the Check for Updates option from the search result. In here, just click on the Check for Updates blue button and wait until Windows finds any updates, and if so, they will be automatically installed on your PC. Another useful solution is to remove the printer and get the latest driver. So press the Windows button, then choose Settings, next select the Bluetooth and Devices from the left pane and then click on Printers and Scanners from the right side. Now click on your printer and select remove. The printer should be uninstalled now and we can get back to installing the drivers properly. Now you should get the latest driver from the manufacturer. This depends of course of the manufacturer you use and I will use the HP printer support for example. So in my browser I just find the model of the printer and then look for the driver or software, expand it and then download it. Lastly you can also install the printer manually. To do this, press the Windows button, then click on the Settings icon, now pick Bluetooth and Devices from the left pane, and then choose Printers and Scanners from the right side. Now click on the Print Server Properties. Select the Drivers tab from the top, look at the list, and if you can't find your printer driver, click on the Add button. This will start the Add Printer Driver Wizard, so just click on Next. Afterwards, select the processor type and hit the Next button. What you have to do now is to identify your printer brand, model and then hit on next. And if you don't see it, click the Windows Update button and in a few seconds the list will be populated with a lot of other printer brands and models. You can also select the Have Disk button if you already have the drivers. Lastly, just click the Finish button after you're done installing it. And that's it. Pretty easy, isn't it? As usual, for more information and details you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.